what is going on everybody in this video you will see me helping you guys giving you a tutorial on how to defeat the boss us defeating ignis and all the bosses each boss is like what they do how to what you should do to avoid it how to defeat the dungeon the basic tips of the dungeon and yeah and i hope you guys stay make sure you guys check out the links below like join my discord follow me on instagram like and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you're new and uh, remember i will be streaming this game and helping all my fans out whenever i can i will be trying this every i will try as much as i can but due to school and other stuff and I, i'm going to programming so like i want to keep learning programming and scripting and all that more so i can be better at that so i won't be able to stream every day that's why i have been like lacking but at least i'm trying to do videos every day for you anyways thank you guys and i will see you inside the video what is going on everybody welcome back to another world zero video so world zero should be released by the time this for everyone by the time this video is uploaded and i am just to here showing you guys a tutorial what level uh, oh, sorry bro i'm doing tower sorry bro i'm doing tower yo okay anyways let's go into town so there is a tower i'm gonna show you guys the tower raid if uh, like if i hope we're successful but i'm gonna show you some tips for it if you like when it's ready and once you're level 60 you'll be able to go here and you don't want to fail right no because the, after this unless they update it after this uh, the, depending on your level is depending on your gear so my highest gear level is 63 right so that means my level is 63 and you can get these items this pet uh for uh like it's really rare it's 10 percent chance and then you can get demon tokens which i have not been farming i've o i only have 22 which is kind of sad so let's hash this egg i got one dragon and yeah and this egg right now let's see what my new pet is i think it's only a dragon that you get from this i do not know where's my pet oh what didn't i hatch it Hatch ready, yeah. Unequip. Equip pet. Hatch egg. Yeah, what? What's wrong with this egg? Unequip. Equip. There's something wrong. Hatch egg. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Currently at the tower, we have one, two, three, four, five, six players, including myself. Here are the chances, 50% for the demon token, 25% uh, for the strawberry, 5 of those, 15% chance for the uh, 5 XP food, 5 of those, and 10% chance for the molten egg that had, so far as I know it, dragons. And the dragon can go into, don't go in, go in, okay whatever, they're not gonna listen to me. I suggest not going in this early bro, there's barely any people, only 4, 5, 6, 7, eight people that's like nothing you need a minimum of at least 12 because by the time you get to the first for seven no they updated so it's every three four so by the time you get to the second boss at least like half of these people might be exterminated or at least like three people that's why i suggest going in with at least 10 people but no they all teleported already so yeah uh yeah so you don't want to go on this you can't go on this tower till you're level 60 Make sure you have at least level 60 gear, a nice pet, and try getting the boar wolf before you go in. Trust me, you will need it. You will need it to go in here. I am not joking to you. You will actually need it to go in here. So yeah, I will uh, wait for the tower to start, guys. So I will see you inside the tower. Okay, guys, I kind of lied. We're not inside the tower, but we have the people. Look at this. These are all the people that are going in. They are, m most of them have mounts. Shout out to these guys. But here we are. We are teleporting for the first time into the first floor. This used to be 25 floors. Every boss is 5 floors each. Uh, Magma, the uh, sword guy, la tall sword guy. I've been dying a lot because uh, I wasn't focusing. I was getting too cocky and I was going on the boss's head to try something like, like new. I wanted to try if they would attack me if I was on their head. They were missing till they used abilities. Like the abilities is scary. See here, you need that. And once you want to go around, you want to look for these chests, right? You want to destroy these chests. But you can't destroy those chests unless if there are mobs in this thing. Those chests give you guys the item. They don't give you the key. As you can see on my left side, there is this. These indicates the floor. Every yellow is a floor boss. 
and the red is the mega boss end boss end game boss whatever you want to call it there we go we cleared the mobs on the floor and there we go i got a demon ticket so you the key does come in a chest but the chest will have a green light around it as you guys can see before i open it it's red right oh okay i opened it by accident i guess i got another demon ticket as you guys can see their chest is red the chest will be green when it has a key inside so you don't you want to like go around you don't want to fight the mobs unless there is a chest you want to get and you got to clear the mods for that and as you can see we're in the trap room right there's only one chest i'm gonna let everyone else escape real quick leave the trap room everyone if you see one chest in the trap room it's guaranteed that like mods will sound it's a trap in this kind of room exit found oh now i have to wait here for 20 seconds i don't want to fight the mods i'm too lazy but yeah it's guaranteed to go off there will be a 50 50 percent chance sometimes if there are two chests and one of them is the trap one of them gives you your items so yeah exit found see once that exit is found you want to follow the screen light and you do not want to waste time you want to make sure you get there before the timer is up or else you are done you won't go to the next floor so here we are heading on to the next floor 35 seconds and boom while we wait for everyone it will keep us on this section for another 30 seconds once everyone comes it will teleport us to the next floor's lobby see there we are and the next floor so yeah that's basically the gist of it gist of this yeah as you can see some rooms are dead end some rooms don't have any chests some rooms are trapped rooms some rooms are good rooms Ah, here we go, a trap room with two chests in it. I'm just gonna destroy this. Ah, that sucks, bro. <laughs> I trapped the dude in here, he's probably pissed at me. And let's destroy this mob, and I got a demon. See, I got a demon from that one. And yeah, those guys are just gonna defeat the mobs down there. And if all the mobs in the room are defeated, then you shall open the gate or you have to wait 20 seconds. So as you can see, I had a 50-50% chance. And here we are. This is the main door. Find the key, look for chests on the floor. So yeah, you want to find the key. You can't enter there until you find the key. See, everyone, all these guys are using things. Remember, it's shift to run. And with the mount, is faster. And you can jump over all these mounts. I mean, sorry, mobs. And here we are, another room. Boom, there's a red there. And oh, there we go. Oh, I see the light key, key, key. There we go. Look at this. See that? That's the key chest. How will I prove it? Wait for them. There we go. And exit has been unlocked. We have unlocked the key. As soon as I open that, see that the green light is the key. And the exit will be backwards. Yeah, but I'm still just gonna go for this. So the next floor will be the boss floor. So I will see you guys on the boss floor. Here we are guys at the 5th uh, floor boss, or I guess 6th floor, uh, he's called Shield of Ignis, he carries a shield and the weapon, he's a guardian, as you can see, that's not his move, that's our move, but as you can see, falling from the sky are swords, that's his move that I keep I kept dying at before, it does a lot of damage, and that one is just flame, but yeah, th that's basically his moves, All you, he's pretty slow, but what you want to, oh no, 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 see that I almost got on. I got on his head and then I jumped out of the place. See that? That's what does a lot of damage. All you want to do is move out of his way, in out of being in front of him. So technically out of his reach and let's just destroy him now. Sion beam from a dragon, X and boom, he's done for. There we go. I'm just going to show you guys a boss fight. Uh, I'm going to have either text or my speech in it. Whichever makes the boss fight look uh, easier for you guys and how to explain it. But I've given you the gist of it. What you require is at least a pet and a, well, mount. And you don't need to fight the mobs unless you want to like grab a chest. But make sure to confirm there's a chest there first. Or else there's no point. You're just like wasting time for yourself, everyone else. And you're not even getting anything. Because these guys don't give XP. Remember that. Power level is determined by the amount of like level of your item that you have and we already found the door so yeah i'll see you guys at the next boss fight
All right, guys, here we are at floor nine. This should be the boss fight. Yeah, it's the big tree guy. Yeah, this guy's annoying. He's slow, he's very slow, but as you can see, he slams into the ground and he has the uh, extra effects of the other mobs, like all the other mobs that use that ability kind of moves. But all you want to do right now is just focus on dodging the swords that are falling from the sky. I think those are his swords. Yeah, I don't know the guardian or yeah, those kind of classes really well other than mage and dueling, berserker, paladin, etc. But see, as you can see, he slams into the ground for pretty high damage. I'm just walking with, and those are the swords and stuff. This one is dangerous. Yeah, he can literally one shot you and spikes. Oh, oh, I helped for nothing. I'm sorry, guys. But yeah, he slams into the ground. You just want to dodge that. Ooh, I got 63 Paladin armor, but I already have level 63 armor, so that's pretty doo doo for me. Yeah. <laughs> He slams into the ground, he like rockets you from his hand when he like slaps you. He just goes out. Please, I'm gonna smack you. Get your out of here. <laughs> you guys don't know what I'm trying to say there. But yeah, he does that and he has extra moves. Normally, this is, I think, this is world two or three mob, three boss. So yeah, he's not that powerful normally. But yeah, with the extra bonus levels and all that, he's pretty powerful. So you want to dodge his slams mainly. The ability doesn't have hurt as much, but as long as you're not in front of him, you will be safer. Very safer. Very safe, I blah. Yeah. So yeah, I will see you guys at the next boss. Okay, guys, here we are at the boss boss place. So yeah, uh, we're going to move on to the next boss. I'm sorry for saying uh, so much. But yeah, if you guys haven't subscribed already, make sure you guys subscribe, hit that notification bell, and like. I'm, I like doing World Zero videos, and this will prove to me that you guys like it too. It is being released for everybody, so I hope this does help you, my tutorials, my gameplay, everything. I am going to be live streaming this, so I hope you guys do join. It's going to be mainly on weekdays, other than those days I have stupid tests and stuff like that. And why am I not helping with the boss? Oh no, ability, ability, ability. Uh, if I die, I'll just watch this and then explain to you guys from like the grave, explain to you guys how to defeat each boss, but I'm like multitasking, so it's pretty good. Make sure you guys want to dodge that. Okay, I'm gonna dodge this. So this boss would be the floor four, last boss. This one is his main thing. Normally on floor four, he will cover himself with this and you have to defeat his extra mob. That one, that ball, you wanna like watch out for that. And then this thing right here, it shoots beans of life. So whenever they come, like it'll go around the room. There's two, and whenever they come for you, you want to like dodge it, and all that. And yeah, other than that, he just has the ability, and he's pretty weak. You can just go head on head. But other than that, you guys have to wait for the ability that he gets from every mob. Like it will place weapons all over here. But yeah. That's the only weakness and the laser beam. As, and as you guys can see, okay, let me just go to this so they can start. But as you guys can see, I got level 64 armor, 35,000. It's a bit stronger than my platinum armor. But yeah, I'm not gonna worry because I upgraded uh, level 62 armor to 49,000 and I just don't feel like upgrading that one until I get at least level 66. But yeah, as you can see, my power level went to level 64. That's now, if someone checks on me, I will have a level 64 on my thing. See, that depends on the gear you get that you level up on this floor, just to prove it to you guys. So yeah, I will see you guys on the final hardest boss. And make sure you guys check out the channel for the live streams. I will be helping all my fans on every floor as much as I can. And we will also be grinding the tower as whenever I stream whenever I do that and if you join the discord I will be posting like times when I'm doing it so you guys can just join me and you guys can like do the tower with me right now I haven't been posting it because it's not free for everyone and look at that there's already the key right there so yeah join the discord subscribe hit the notification bell watch out for links and check out the rest of my social links down below and here is the exit my social links such as Instagram discord Twitter Roblox uh, yeah hmm yeah so yeah follow those and I will see you guys at the floor boss okay guys here we are on Ignis uh, the guy set up a trap so I got kind of mad when we were on the timer here we are the Ignis and the last boss 
Oh, look at the entrance. My second or third time on doing this boss. Yeah, I have completed him before, and as you can see, I have his Ignis wings. This is the mighty dragon right here, and as you can see, you will want to watch out for these traps. He's just the same as the floor, the winter floor boss, the end boss. Yeah, I think that's floor two. Yeah, I think that's floor two. Oh, uh, that's my no, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Look at that, he's so powerful. Look at that big meteor just coming at you, and he's all the way. Where'd he go? Did, did he go up? He's shooting from the sky, but I don't see him. I think it's ah, oh, there he is. He was out of view. The second time he goes for that, it's gonna be an active shield. You'll have, I think, 15 seconds. To get behind an active shield if you don't make it you will instantly be killed no matter how much hp you have i have 54 hp and i get insta shotted okay he's almost down we have two more health bars going for us it's gotten much easier to complete this because uh like they downgraded it from 25 floors to 15 floors so it takes a lot less time and people don't get bored it's 15 seconds get behind it the active shield not the other two shields, the active shield is the one with the white in it. Those two shield, two shields are not active and you could die. Five seconds. You have to stand inside the white and wait for it. Three, two, one, and go. Two shields remaining, but that doesn't really matter if you're like this strong. That's why I recommended a bunch of players for... No, 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 sir. No, I do not accept that kind of behavior here. I shall ex extinguish you from this world sir there we go there we go sure <gasps> no 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 bad behavior sure that's bad behavior that's bad behavior sir 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 we do not accept that kind of behavior at walmart thank you boom 27 minutes to complete it and as you can see there are four chests you get all four of them no matter even if you don't have the game pass so what do i get from this one okay I got level 64 battle axe, great axe, battle axe, um, 65, yay, yeah, 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 I get two levels, <gasps> 66 dragonkin armor, that's the rare armor guys, that's the rare armor, it's only level 66, yeah, but that's the rare armor, you do not want to lose this, this is the rarest armor in the game, <sighs> yo yeah, bro, well actually level 75 and higher versions of this is rare, but you know what I mean, yeah, let's go at it. We gained what level did we start here? 63? We started at 63, I think. So we gained like three levels on this. Yeah. That is me defeating the tower and getting the Dragon Kin armor, bro. Dragon Kin, that will be clipped as another video other than this one. I just want to clip that into its own video. Let me prove to you guys. Oh, okay, there's all of us. World event, the big blossom tree. Why am I. What the heck is happening here? Okay, buddy. <laughs> what? What was that? Let me prove to you guys that the Dragon Cairn is like the rarest armor. It is the rarest armor in the game, the one I got. So, uh, I forgot how you did it. Was it this thing? No. You go in here. Dragon Kin, 4% chance. And Blossom Field, of course. But look at that. There's different versions of it. There's 0% because I'm not that class. But the Dragon Kin is the rarest. It can be used for all classes. So yeah, higher versions of it is of course rarer. But yeah, let's wear it guys. Let's see how it looks. Dragon Killer armor, ready? Oh, I look like a samurai. Yo. Boom, put that away. Boom, I'm I'm so hot. <laughs> oh my God, this is gonna be its own clip when I be battling Ignis, bro. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys check out the Discord. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Roblox. If you want to join my games, you must be following me. And join our Roblox group. We have to start a new one because I lost my account for Pixelated Holder due to uncertain reasons. And then I don't have an email for that one. So I technically fully lost that account. So I can't revive it at all. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you're new. Hit that notification bell and like the video. And make sure you check out for my streams. I will be streaming and helping people out. Just it won't be a schedule because I have school, I have work, I have I have tests. It's all online, so it's way harder for me because like in school they tell you like that, and you have your own time. But here you have to 
like schedule it out you got to find time to like yeah all that is very difficult you could have two classes at once so that's pretty hard for me so yeah thank you guys for watching and peace out pixel army